and that Malice is it. Is down and out. Kamaru is very skilled and very talented fighter. He's ranked number 10. He's undefeated in the UFC, 6-0. Uh, hasn't lost a single round yet, so definitely like a super good athlete and good fighter. Not really any weaknesses. Mac just throwing bombs. I believe Emil has some strong points in his game. He he likes to fight, so that that's a good, that's a big part of it. I believe this is going to be a tough fight. I don't believe my octagon experience is going to be that much of an advantage because it's a fight. Anything can happen in a fight. He likes to just be in a brawl, a, a street fight, a fist fight. That's the type of fights that he likes. I feel ready for it. To fight the number 10 guy, that's what I want. I want I want to be in the rankings. I want to be in the very top of the UFC. I want to fight and beat the best guy there is. Very tiring when you have someone stalking you the way Mar Usman is just pushing a pace. When I'm in fights, the fights go the way that I want them to go. So it's my job to control everything that happens and make sure once again, it looks very easy. I think the fight will be like one of the like epic brawls, one of the best fights of the year. I feel strong now. I feel fast and I feel, I feel pretty invincible. In every one of my fights, I dominate from start to finish. If I go in there and I breathe on him and he falls over in the, in the first minute, hey, I'll take that. But if not, I'll do what I do best and that slowly break his will. I like to, to break his soul, and he's another victim. Until I hit Kumaro with the right, or the left, or something, and then he will start wrestling. I'm into this, in this sport, to be the best at it. Not just for money, or, or for fame, or anything like that. I want to prove that I'm the best in the world. I've trained, and I've put myself in position to be the best in the world. I'm expecting a top five fight after this.